Well, chaos on a San Francisco street this morning. A bus driver loses control, slams into another bus, leaving five people injured. The crash happened about 9.30 on Fremont Street near Folsom. Our Susie Steimel is live at that intersection where Good Samaritans rushed in to help out. Susie? That's right, Alan. We're at the 200 block of Fremont Street. This has been closed all day since 920 this morning when that accident took place. The bus actually hopped over the curb at this intersection of Folsom and Fremont Streets, then came careening down this direction. If you come with me, I'll show you. It took out several trees, bushes, and even chewed up the cement along the way alongside of these buildings here. And if you, it traveled a uh, half of a city block. If you look down on the sidewalk here, you can see the skid marks, and that stoplight is where it eventually came to a stop. And I heard a loud noise and saw this bus here out of the corner of my eye, and it looked like it was about to tip over. Chad Preston says his initial reaction to seeing a bus careening down the sidewalk on Fremont Street was purely instinctual. So I ran over there to try to help. He climbed on board the bus. That's where he met the driver, still at the wheel. Investigators say somehow she lost control. And she was unconscious at first. And I just wanted to keep her alert, conscious, um, and just make sure that she didn't pass out. She did great. Danielle Marquis works at a dental office nearby. She teamed up with multiple construction workers to keep that bus driver alert before first responders could take her to the hospital. But it's very clear she was lightheaded and momentarily lost consciousness just based on what she said and then also based on what the passengers who were jumping off of the bus were saying as they were leaving the bus. AC Transit tells us two buses exited I-80 onto Fremont Street. One attempted to make a right turn onto Folsom Street. The other bus was behind it and should have been attempting to make the same turn but lost control. First hitting two passenger vehicles, then the first bus before it went onto the sidewalk, coming to a rest between Folsom and Howard Streets. This is incredibly uncommon. This is one of our normal routes. It's one of our most popular routes. We transport nearly 30,000 people across the uh, Bay Bridge every single day. Police tell us a total of five people were, spent, were sent to the hospital, and despite all of this, all five are expected to be just fine. Live in San Francisco, Susie Steimel, KPIX 5.